And the east northeast wind is actually helping to uh, keep us on the cooler side as the uh, wind is coming off of the waters. And you can see here, radar is quiet, nothing to show you guys here, no rain just yet. We're looking at a few showers coming in for later on tomorrow, but we'll get to that in just a second. Three key things cooler this weekend, temperatures in the 60s for both days. Showers return though, like I said, for tomorrow afternoon. But then good news is the sunshine returns, and so does that mild feel coming back for early next week. Temperatures right now, like I said, upper 50s, low 60s all across the area. 58 in Smithfield, 59 in Newport, 60 in New Bedford. So you get the idea here. Cool, chilly, fall-like. Wind direction to wind speeds, not that windy out there. About 5 to 10 miles per hour. But notice the arrows from the east and northeast that's coming off of the cooler waters of the Atlantic, helping to bring those clouds and keep us on the cool side. Satellite and radar, you can see all those clouds I'm talking about pretty much over all of southern New England. However, up in Maine, our friends up in Maine are seeing a nice day overall with sunshine. But that's thanks to the high pressure to the north and east. But it's helping to fight off this low pressure system just a little bit out to the uh, south of us near the Carolinas. Now, that's going to be bringing us more clouds and the chance of showers coming in for tomorrow as it slowly makes its way up the coast and eventually turns away from us. But it's going to be close enough to give us some clouds and a few showers from time to time through your Sunday. So let's time things out with today. And you can see this afternoon, cloudy skies, temperatures in the upper 50s, low 60s by this evening. Again, staying pretty uh, dry, just cloudy skies right through tonight. Places north and west of Providence should get down to the mid-50s. Everyone else, upper 50s to near 60, so temperatures won't really move all that much. By tomorrow morning, still cloudy skies starting out your day. And notice there's some specks of green under the map. That's the rainfall coming in during the afternoon hours. Again, very spotty, very light in nature. Here's 3 p.m., a few spotty showers coming through. Not a big deal, not a washout. And not everyone's going to see a shower tomorrow anyways. So as we go into tomorrow evening, again, cloudy skies. That threat for a shower does continue later into tomorrow night and into Monday morning as well. But overall, not a major deal by any concern. Now, tonight's forecast, again, mainly cloudy. Temperatures in the mid to upper 50s. Drizzle and fog possible, winds east around 5 to 15 miles per hour. Now for tomorrow morning's forecast, you can see here, again, mainly cloudy. That's the theme we're going with. Cloudy skies right through Sunday. Temperatures in the upper 50s, low 60s by the middle of the day. Spot sprinkle, that shower chance does increase during the afternoon. If you're finding yourself out on the water tomorrow, not the best day, not the worst day. Cloudy skies, temperatures, again, in the upper 50s and low 60s for tomorrow. And overall, clouds and showers around. Now, our seven-day forecast, after tomorrow, it does improve. So you can see here, Sunday, chance of showers coming our way. Monday, an early shower. Temperatures back into the 70s. Tuesday, bright and mild. Highs near 70. One more shower chance coming on a Wednesday. But as we wrap up the work week and head into next weekend, temperatures will be in the 70s with plenty of sunshine. And as always, you can turn to WPR.com for your latest forecast update. Coming up in 